Oh. I need to find now I actually... Okay. That's rude. Oh, okay. There's one right... Like, literally right there. I was like, why do I have to... Like, I, do you think with the override that we just did... I should be able to jump onto the tall neck from here. If I knew that was going to be a thing, I could have run up here a little bit quicker, but... Uh, let's see. I don't really use my spear a whole lot. Does that... Oh, no, because it affects these ones. Okay. You're not talking about the tall necks. Are you? Oh, no kidding. Huh. That's interesting. I mean, it would make sense. Allow her, allow her to keep an eye on things. Those watchers? No. Gotcha. That makes sense. And why they're... Like, each of them has their own territory. Like, their little subset of areas that they're supposed to deal, supposed to deal with. Okay, tall neck, walk faster. Although I guess it would be terrifying if they walked too much faster. There's a little shadowed area here where she, where the tall neck doesn't see. That's interesting. Huh. Weird. Server lock. Monitoring. 
electrical impact. Snow makes visibility really suck. <laughs> I mean, snow does that anyway, but... Bergman said Araya's apprentice went north of the river. Hopefully not too far. A badger? Looking out at that tower. What the hell is that? Repairs and provides shock resistance to hostile machines. Stuns overridden machines. Huh. What's up, dude? Naltuk? Who are you? How did you find me? Bergrind told me you'd be out here. He's persistent. I've told that Asaram a thousand times. I don't need to buy anything. And I'm not selling. I just need to find Araya. Well, you won't. She's gone where only shamans can tread. She seeks guidance from the voice in the blue light. That is her task. Nice hat. And the task she gave me is to observe the daemon's work. To stop it spreading, if I can. What can I do about these towers? In only a few weeks, they've sprouted throughout the cut. The daemon's energy pulses from them. Rallies the machines, even repairs them. Aratok said this daemon was... Hmm. frenzying machines? Look there. Those with the purple markings. They belong to the daemon. They're stronger, more dangerous. I've seen something like this before. A corruption. But it wasn't from your daemon. You have? Then you know more than I do. Maybe. These towers, were they part of your corruption? No. Those are new to me, too. Like I said, they empower the Damien's machines. They must be stopped. Will you tell me where Aurea went? You ask a lot of questions. Yes. Only when I'm not getting the answers I need. <laughs> There's but one voice Aurea wants to hear right now, and it isn't yours. I'm sorry. All right. You want to stop the spread of the Damien's work? I know how to get started. With my bow and spear. Outlander, wait. What? Won't you tell me your name? No. Aloy. Good. If you fall to the Damon's machines, at least I can properly recount your efforts to Araya. <laughs> Thanks for the vote of confidence. <laughs> but I won't fall. And when I'm done, you're gonna tell me where she is. Just like generic damage. Yes. I can kill the machines. Yo, what? Am I hallucinating or did that? Knock out my armor? Shields overloaded by that pulse nice. from the tower.
heals them. He even said that. Just normal for me. So now I probably gotta go talk to dude again. We should speak. Cold. This 
Seems I can take care of the machines and towers. The daemon's next. You claimed its power for yourself somehow. Perhaps Aurea should meet you after all. What she truly seeks is hope. After what I just saw, you could show her that. She's in retreat beyond those mountains, the ice rasps. You'll have to walk the shaman's path to get there. You'll know you've Sounds reached ominous. the end when you come to a shrine, a great machine covered in blue gleam. Shamans who complete the path take a piece of it as reward. Can I take all if of it? If you make it that far, you should too. You'll have earned it. You said something about blue gleam at the end of the shaman's path? A crystal that builds on the bodies of machines in the oldest ice. We Banuk believe it's the stuff of the blue light, frozen as it escapes their shells. You might be more interested that merchants will trade well for it. You're not wrong. Bergen told me you're Araya's apprentice. In her absence, I serve the chieftain and his Werak as an advisor, a scout, a speaker for the blue light. A lot of responsibilities. I don't know if I can live up to Araya's example, but I have to try. I owe her that much. She took a chance on me, an aspiring shaman from the edge of the world. No one else would. Were you with Aurea when they attacked the mountain? I wish I had been, even with all that happened. I'm no warrior, though, so she bid me wait. When Aurea and the chieftain returned, I saw them argue bitterly. I don't know what about exactly. Then she came to me, gave me my task, and left us. How do I cross this shaman's path? Go to the ice rasps. Then follow the markers through the ice caves and the waterfalls, and make the climb to the shrine. But be careful. The path is meant to be an ordeal, the final trial of a young shaman's training. And I'll find Araya at the end of it? No. She goes further up, somewhere inside the mountain. If you see her, would you tell her? I have faith she will hear the voice again. Hmm. All right, I guess I'm off to the ice rasps to find this shaman's path. Later, dude. Guy is out. All right. Are there no other quests along the way? This one's close. Let's go do this real quick. Oh. Pretty much on the way anyway. Nice. Oh yeah, I was gonna look at the notebook. You can apparently break them too. Kind of neat. Sound terrible. Ooh. Oh, good. Demonic snap jaws. That's lovely. Oh, at least they're still weak to fire.
seriously not gonna come? Come on. You jerk. in the mouth. weird that he can burn while sitting in the water, but, you know. Video games. Okay, bye. I can get out of this. Why would I want to get out of this? Oh, do I have to kill the other one, too? Find its source. Seems like.
much better. I have to leave something else behind. That's fine. Okay. Oh, just follow the river. Okay. Sounds good. These mountains Hard must be point arrow hits. Okay. The shaman's path begins somewhere up above. Yeah. When he's doing his like spitting ice thing up into the air. Screen, nice. <laughs> Flooding detected. Evacuation recommended. Overflow basin compromised. The overflow basin. Is that the bin? Okay. Looks like a control center. Oh, hey, with more what puzzles. happened in here to start the water flowing? Ooh. Piece is missing. Not getting in here without it. Okay. Intake malfunction. Intake tower malfunction. Drainage system offline. That's probably not good news. Looks like the most of the facility is under water. How did this happen? This could turn something up. Someone's been through here. Not that long ago. I'm a ghost crab compound! Well, what did you do? Okay. We'll go in in a second. Did you not bring a pry bar? Well, 
You don't know how happy you just made me. <laughs> Is this another merchant? For a moment, I thought my fire was snuffed. The forge gone cold. But nope, nope. Not old Gildan. You're welcome. Uh, wait. Start from the beginning. What are you doing down here? Ow! My apologies. <laughs> when you mostly talk to yourself, you can tell your stories in whatever order you like. There's an artifact in that storage room I simply must acquire. But as you may have noticed, the door won't budge. I took one of those roundish, ringy what's-its from the wall beside the door. No luck. So I had to go with that panel with the button. Even less luck. My gentle yeah, experimentation but... caused the chamber to... Blow up? Blood. So I pushed the button again, perhaps a little too enthusiastically. Sparks yeah, no, I was thinking about the the merchant from the beginning when we first got into the, the village. My cautious footsteps may have contributed slightly to the collapse of a bridge. And when the bridge began to collapse, I may have, for the sake of expedience, ah, yes. abandoned the cumbersome ringy what's it to the waves. By the time I thought to give up the endeavor, the door had closed behind me. And thusly do we come to the present moment. You said something about an artifact? Indeed. That storage room is brimming with treasures from the old ones. But one in particular caught my eye. An intricate looking glass. I've only seen one such device before. My old mom brought one back for me from, from wherever she'd gone to that time. I remember holding it. Staring into its face, seeing myself and my mother just over my shoulder, smiling. And one of these looking glasses, it's in the storage room. Oh, yes, I'm quite sure. I peered into that dim little chamber, and there it was. I've wanted to find one for so long. I, yes, this time I'm sure I have. Well, there's no way we're getting into that storage room without another ring. It's part of the locking mechanism that controls the door. You don't say. Well, that's fantastic news. Marvelous, even. You've got two hands. I've got two hands. Perfect. <laughs> my savior, my salvation. What? And if you like, why wouldn't you? Of course you will. My accomplice. <laughs> Together, that ring is as good as ours. And with it, the storage room and its spoils. Didn't you say you dropped the ring in the water? Well, I'll grant you that adds a heretofore undiscussed level of complexity to the proceedings. So you found the button that controls the flow of water. Quite by accident. And then you broke that button. Also quite by accident. The panel's the only way to shut this place down, as far as I can tell. This isn't going to be easy. That storage room is filled, top to bottom. Would you be surprised to find the parts you need in there? I certainly wouldn't be. So, we need to replace that ring and get into the storage room. Then I can fix the panel and shut this place down. And I can finally wrap my fingers around that looking glass. Okay, Gildan. How are we going to get that ring? Two sets of hands, girl! Two sets of hands! Behind us lie a pair of enormous gates, but I believe the gates must be operated in tandem. Together, we can dry this place out. Guess we better get started then. I guess we better. Up ahead, girl. See the valve? Time to put our hands to use. I'll take care of this one. There's another valve on the other side to lock the gate in place. Would you mind heading across and uh, doing the honors? Where? The other valve is just across the uh, raging flood waters. You know, I'm reminded of Adele by understanding his plan. Interesting.
You made it. Now grab that valve and give it a spin. On it. Hmm. A little more now, and I should be able to get the blasted gate moving. There. You should be able to lower the gate. Huh? Right you are. Now, when I get this gate down, you'll need to turn the valve again. I want to lock this thing in place. One gate down. Halfway through then, aren't we? To the second gate! A ladder is a rare and special thing, girl. You can depend on it to take you exactly where you need to go and no further. Okay. Hmm. I'd wager the valves for the second sluice gate are somewhere above us. How are we gonna get up there? Let me look around. See what I can... Looks like I could jump across on that... rickety resting platform. I find a way up. Go. Just gonna drop us in the water, but here we go. Nice! Oh, maybe not. <laughs> nice! What am I saying? That was stupendous! Not too much already. Seen such absolute disregard for personal safety. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> I think. Yeah, I do that a lot. Ooh. Time for the apocalypse, then you got to do what you Oh, can. you're close, girl. Just spring across the gap. Easy for you to say. Ah, huh? you're right above me. Just send that ladder on down. Look out below. Okay. Now we've done this once before. Should be as easy as falling down a hole. If you take the valve on the other oh. side, let's set up the same way on this side. I should look for an access to it. Yeah. This, this is my sort of doubt. Shut up, does he? My goodness. Mattering on and on and on. Uh huh, Gildan. Oh, 
Mushrooms. Okay, Gildan, turn the valve. Yeah, it's not working. Damn thing's too heavy. Glance behind me, would you? See anything big and uh, broken? Looks like part of the counterweight broke off. If I can get up there, my weight might be enough to get it moving again. Uh, hang on, okay? I've got a plan. I need to get up higher. I climb up that wreckage. That's pretty much what I do now. Oh. Okay. I guess I just swim out of... Oh, wait. This? No. Yeah, I guess that is the way up. I guess I just have to be... Is there another way up there that's not... Yeah, because I just keep hopping over this. Ooh, uh. it's too strong. Come on. I can't swim against it. It's even less refreshing than it looks. Wasn't trying to... Oh, wait. No. Blazing Forge, girl! Careful! Don't want you drowning in this ruin now, do we? It seems like that should be the way, but do I have to, like, sprint up the thing and jump? <laughs> oh, we just had to take, like, two steps farther. Up. Up. An utter nut job. Holy shit. Well, that's not good. 
Oh. Okay. Guess it could be worse. Face out of the way. This place is full of surprises. Should we have a look? Didn't you want to get into the storage room? I do. Fervently. But we drained enough well, water for what we need I to do. I got time to poke my nose in if you did. I wonder if I could empty out the whole dam. Needed the wash. Pipes, valves. Maybe I can drain the rest of the water from here. All right, time to get the flow going to the right place. I say this as a So that the pump flows, water flows directly to the pump. The rest of the servitors seem to get it. Okay. And typically enamored of complexities, but this looks like it might be a little much for me. Don't worry, I think I've got this. Music to my ears. To each job, it's proper tool. Oh. Toothpicks make horrible arrows, it's as like the saying puzzle. goes. Got a confident mind, girl. A mind for nuance and finesse. Not I. <laughs> no, indeed. Not old Gildan.
This job demands a certain degree of patience. I'm afraid I inherited my mother's restlessness. There. One step closer. Should be it, right? There, that should do it. I should head back. See if that's okay for us. Got it working, did you? <laughs> of course you did. Never met a conundrum you couldn't unconundrum, have you? The door's open. I guess it had sealed because of the flooding. This must go down to the lower level. Okay. Ugh, it stinks down here. You smell that? It smells like a Ford side morning in the claim. Have to ditch something. Well, then we will ditch something. That looks cool as shit. What was that? I should head back up with Gildan. I did not mean to uh, drop those. Oop. Okay. That's pretty good. Although, shock is not going to be very good here, right? Freeze. So should that go... That would go on my sling, right? Yeah, I do have that perk, right? I picked that up. Yeah, I think my Vorbo is just so decked out with fire right now. Hey, Moon. Thank you, thank you. I like little puzzles like that. They're very cool. As we circle back around to the matter of the supply room? Yes, we're going. Is that the one that just does the elemental damage? Oh, wait. Almost there! Soon I'll hold the looking glass in my hand. Just like Mum and I used to. Positions. 
purple. Uh, left, up, down, up, right. Left, uh, up. What? Um. What are you doing with your hands there, girl? Mind your business. <laughs> I can't believe that worked. I thought you'd lost your mind tickling the empty air like that. <sighs> Where is it? I Where mean, did it go? This is it. We get to play together, what, maybe two more times? Nah, shells. Farewell tour! Reunion tour in like six months. <laughs> they do it all the time. <laughs> For our adoring fans. It's not that hard to see. Could have sworn I saw one in here. Practice in all space. People always say that. Should have brought a cart. the one thing I wanted. Yeah, I think I do have a bunch of uh, glass eyes floating around. Okay, let's fix the panel and shut this place down. Must be in here. Gilda? Everything okay? I was so sure I saw it. The looking glass. I was so sure. Nope, just clock. Right there in the window. I would... Course. Trick of the light. Nothing at all. Oh, poor guy. I'm sorry, Gildan. It must have meant a lot to you. Oh, no. Much as any artifact of the old ones would mean to me, really. It's fine. Uh, I'm fine. <laughs> Besides, what are the spoils compared to the Delve? That's why we do it, girl. <laughs> the Delve, not the treasure. <laughs> And what a delve it was! Ugh. By the great blazing forge, I'll never forget that. Now then, I uh, believe we have some repairs to make. Poor guy. I kind of feel bad for him. <laughs> Please don't touch anything, dude. Aww. Oh, that's a whole lot prettier, isn't it? <laughs> what does it mean? <laughs> it 
means it worked. By the forge! Ha! You are a wonder! Do you hear that often? I'll hazard a guess you do. I've heard something like that once or twice. Oh, she's modest now. A master of the arts of the old ones, a delver to shame the entire claim, and she wants to be modest. Ha! It's not like I did it alone, Gildan. Totally how side question me. No, I suppose not. So what's next for you? On your way back to the claim? And deprive the people of Song's Edge the story of this encounter? Perish the thought! <laughs> I'll stay there a while longer. But a story is best told by all who encountered it. Come and lend a hand, won't you? 